What's going on, guys? Uh, I thought I'd shoot a quick video here, show you guys um, these Mustangs. It's a '91 Mustang. Uh, you guys know 302. We've been there, done that. Um, anyway, the PCV valve. When you take it out, it's a big, big, big thing. A lot of guys don't know this. There's actually a screen that is underneath this PCV valve. You want to make sure to get that out and get it cleaned if you don't replace it. I ordered all the stuff through Ford. Um, I work there at the dealership as a mechanic, so I get a little bit of a discount. Um, either way, it's cheap. Uh, I think a normal cost is like 30 bucks, maybe 25 bucks, and you get the PCV valve, the grommet, and the screen. The screen is kind of a pain to get out. Um, I've seen a lot of different techniques. This is the one that works best for me. Um, so I thought I'd show it to you guys. All I've got is just a wood screw. Um, this is what I had quick and handy. A smaller screw works better, but this one's got a pretty sharp tip. Um, so I think it'll work. Um, either way, all you do is we come back here to where the grommet, or the little screen is, and if you look, you'll see that screen down in there. We take this, we start it, shove it down, and... We get it in there and get it started and then just pull up and look at there. And this is it. This is one out of mine. Holy cow. Yeah, you guys can look and see how crudded up how crudded up these get. They get nasty. Mine's got some junk from when I pulled the PCV valve out. You guys saw the other video on that. That was a nightmare. Um, I've seen a lot of guys just throw, throw these in a bucket of acetone and clean them out. If you are going to reuse this one, you do not want to use a screw this big because, um, as you can see, it puts a couple holes in there. Not anything major, but it does put some holes. Um, if, if you're going to reuse it, get use a smaller one. Oh my gosh, look at that. That looks a little flaky. Uh-oh, we may have some other issues. Um, either way, oh, maybe it's not. No, it's just lighting. Uh, either way. If you're going to reuse it, make sure to clean it really well. Um, if not, man, they're cheap, guys. Just go buy new ones. Um, I'm all for saving a buck, but sometimes it's just cheaper to go buy new ones. Um, all right, I thought I'd show a quick tip. Uh, put it back in, just drop it in and go. Uh, there's a, a bottom end to it, so it'll bottom out before um, before it goes through. It can't go through because of that. So, Either way, guys, I just wanted to show you. Peace.